Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am here with a new to me vendor haul. Um, I do have the background different. It's just a little piece of tissue paper that was in the box for this company. And um, let me tell you what the company is so it makes sense. <laughs> I thought it was cute. I don't know. Um, but this is uh, Woof Wicks. It's candles for dog lovers and the owners are Amber and Steven. They are like a couple that do this company together and I found her on Etsy so if you're wondering if you want to place an order you can screenshot this. Um, do follow her on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube. Uh, she's awesome. And then it just came with another one. Thank you for your support. You're possum. Which is super cute. Um, and then she wrote me a little note. It says, Nicole, thank you so much for, um, for your support. I really appreciate it. Enjoy your mouth, Amber. So I thought that was super nice. Yeah, okay. Now, <laughs> sorry, I lost my train of thought. The packaging was awesome. Very cute, as you could tell, the tissue paper. I just thought it would be like a cute little background to this uh, video. So let's get in with the samples. She did give a lot of samples. I was super shocked by that. Very, very generous. Um, so the first one we have here is Orange Sherbert, and I just love her packaging. It's very, very cute. It's got a little husky on there. And this smells amazing. It smells like an uh, it almost smells like an orange creamsicle to me i get a little like a vanilla it's very sweet very nice very creamy kind of orange vanilla type fragrance the next one we have is maraschino cherry seven up pound cake this one is really good you get the seven up pound cake it's very strong very sweet little citrusy um, I don't pick up too much cherry, but this one is really good. I would order this um, in a regular size. Alright, the next one is Yabba Dabba Doo Fruity Pebbles Saltwater Taffy Fizzy Pop. Really cute sample. These are a good size sample too. This one, ugh, I don't care for. I just don't like that Fruity Pebbles in there. It's very citrusy. I definitely smell the, you know, the cereal. I do smell the fizzy pop, but it's not like a super strong fizz. The next one is Grape Snuggle Fabric Softener. This one is like spot on like snuggle fabric softener. It smells like the blue sparkle one. Very, very strong. The grape is on the lighter side, but I feel like snuggle is a very strong scent. It kind of overpowers everything. And the last sample we have is fluffy slush puppy blue raspberry slushy cotton candy. Look how cute that is. And this one, oh my lanza. This is so so good it's so sweet you definitely pick up that uh blue raspberry slush the cotton candy adds so much more sweetness to it it's so good i need like boatloads of this scent it's amazing so that were all the samples so very generous so let's get into the uh little packs here all i have are the two pack of paws and these were two dollars and fifty cents so a great price so the first one we have is wildberry mousse pancakes this one is not bad uh, i do get like the pancake batter um not really much of a maple scent in here uh and the wildberry mousse is very very strong in this one it's very sweet uh if you smelled wildberry mousse it kind of smells like every other one with like a pancake batter we have these paws in the scent maraschino cherry blue raspberry slushy blue cotton candy fizzy pop 
very patriotic for uh, 4th of July. And these smell very good. I get the cherry, I get the blue raspberry, the fizzy pop definitely in here. It's very, very citrusy, very sweet, slightly tart um, from the, the maraschino cherry. Such a great summer blend. It reminds me of like a carnival or something. Alright, the next one we have is Grapefruit, Satsuma, Watermelon, Lime, and Coconut. These are two, two layered, so very, very cute. This one is very nice. It kind of, kind of reminds me of like Tang, like that orange scent in here. Yeah, definitely reminds me of like Tang. From that Satsuma. I do get grapefruit. It's a very citrusy, sweet scent. Coconut, it's on the lighter side. I don't really pick up much coconut or watermelon. It's a very citrusy, kind of sweet blend. Oh, you can see my candles in the background kind of holding up the, the background there. <laughs> um, all right, moving on. That's all right. We have Saltwater Taffy Fizzy Pop. This one, again, I got a lot of Fizzy Pop, it seems. It kind of smells like lemon lime drink. Like, exactly like a lemon lime soda. Not, not too much to say on that one. Next one we have is Blonde Moment, which is ice champagne, raspberry, and cranberry, blended with cotton candy and strawberry. Cute little paws again. Like I said, these are all paws, and they are all $2.50. This one is actually really nice. The Blonde Moment is typical kind of grape, grape scent to me. That's what I smell when I smell Blonde Moment. The strawberry is really good. It adds an extra sweetness to it. Very nice fruity blend. The next one is Kool-Aid Watermelon Bubblegum. Look at all different colors in there. Super, super pretty. That glitter. This one is really nice. Her watermelon is very sweet, very candy-like. I wouldn't say it smells like Jolly Rancher watermelon. Um, the bubblegum, I honestly, I don't really smell much of bubblegum in here, which is surprising because it's usually strong. Just a sweet kind of watermelon uh, blend. The next one is cake batter, ice cream, strawberry frosting, yellow cake, sugar cookie dough. So a lot in there. Um, very, very cute. And this one smells so good. You get the cake batter. It smells like a yellow cake batter. And the cookie dough definitely gets very sweet. Her strawberry. Oh, her strawberry is a good, good strawberry. So it's a very nice kind of sweet strawberry bakery scent. Uh, the sugar cookie dough definitely stands out. It's really really good the next one is blackberry mango sorbet marshmallow and these paws are so cute this one oh man this one's really good her blackberry is amazing very sweet again very sweet fruity blend the mango adds so much more to it. Her blackberry is not floral. It's a very authentic blackberry scent. So I'm really happy about that one. Um, I would order more of that. Definitely. The next one was a clearance tart. Because this was from Christmas. And it is two layers. Um, very, very cute. It says a big size. The paws are big too. I could definitely... Um, let me show you. I could definitely half these and get like 
cut them in half this way. You can get two melts out of that, so it's a good size. So this one is Pine Toasted Marshmallow Campfire Breezes. This is so good. Oh man, reminds me of Christmas. Definitely Marshmallow Fireside in Pine. It's like a sweet guest, amazing. So good. I love Marshmallow Fireside. Never used to really care for it, but starting to really like it. And the last two pack of paws we have are Chocolate Orchid Chocolate Layer Cake Marshmallow Vanilla Bean. Uh, Noel, sorry. These are super cute. Very pretty. And oh my gosh, this is probably my favorite scent out of this whole uh, haul except this. Like this one and the one I'm smelling now is probably my favorite. I don't know why we're having trouble. There we go. Wasn't focusing. It's the chocolate orchid is almost like perfumey but with the chocolate cake it's like bakery. So it's like a perfumey chocolate bakery if that makes sense. It smells divine. Oh, like I want to go on the site and order more. It smells that good. I could eat this <laughs> if I could, but I'm not going to, uh, obviously, for obvious reasons. Yes, 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 yes. This is, uh, why aren't we focusing here? There we go. This is hoard worthy. It is so good. I'm very happy I bought this. I will definitely order more of this. So that is all for my Wolf Wicks haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, definitely hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that little notification bell so you get notified every time I upload. And once again, I really, uh, I'm going to hold this up. I really enjoyed this company. She has really great wax for really cheap prices. Like I said, definitely check her out at wolfwicks.com um, or on her Etsy page. She's awesome. And the shipping was pretty uh, decently priced. Uh, I can't think how much I paid it. I think it was like seven something. So like kind of normal shipping. Um, but she did do quick shipping. And yeah, definitely check her out. I keep repeating myself, but do that it's so she has great products and i'm probably going to place an order with her um eventually once i get around to melting some of her stuff to tr uh, try her wax out i cannot talk today so i apologize it's been a rough couple of weeks uh anyway <laughs> i'm gonna end this video here like i said like this uh video subscribe if you're new and thank you so much for watching bye